it's always exciting. It's not a boring office job. It's always different. I could see multiple people all day and I could help them and everyone's happy to see you. When I was in high school, they had offered the opportunity to do a tech prep program at Auburn. And I was like, well, I'm bored. If I have the chance to get out of school for two years and learn a skill, I want to do that. I'm Elizabeth Duncan, I'm 20 years old, and I'm a paramedic. My family was really trying to push me towards nursing because everyone else in my family is a nurse. <laughs> But I started to attend um, Auburn Career Center for EMS, their emergency medical services program. And I ended up falling in love with it completely. I got to go to clinicals, hands-on skills, got my EMT the same week I graduated high school. But everyone's like, get a college degree, do this. So then I was going to uh, University of Cincinnati for psychology. I was in class and one of my friends had a seizure in class, a really bad one, and no one knew what to do. People started crying, so immediately I just got up and I went to help him. I was like, I'm an EMT, I can help this. And after that day, I kind of texted my old teacher, I was like, I just helped someone today, and I said, I kind of want to go back to, I think I know what my passion is and what I want to do. It was really hard doing school during COVID. I was working uh, at an internship all summer and it was in class still and during COVID I wasn't even able to work that much either because at the cafe they cut everyone's hours so I had no money and then I had to pay for fire school. Luckily everything worked out because the CARES Act actually helped me pay back everything. It's a requirement to work at a fire department. As a paramedic, you have to have your fire card. And so my last step was getting my fire card and I was kind of avoiding it for a few years. Being a girl in fire, it's pretty intimidating. It's like all the guys are big and strong. And you're always told like, you know, you gotta work 10 times harder than them. Every day it's gym class, it's like, and I was never good at gym class. <laughs> but everything I've wanted to do, I've been able to achieve that goal. So I'm just gonna keep going. I'm excited to really kick my butt and learn and to finally like be a healthcare professional. Like I feel proud and honored. Everything is a path towards another thing. And I just wanna see where it leads me.